<laughs> um, uh, I don't, I actually, I only like, oh, well, never mind. Who cares what I have to say? Um, so it's going to be Robin versus Lucas, which is uh, a very interesting matchup. Haven't seen this matchup here, um, I think, ever. Uh, pretty crazy. Um, if Dare loses stock, okay, we're good. He's, he's smart enough. He's, he's good. Oh, PK fire, so strong. But they're both going to send out their, uh, their basic side Bs, um, which are well, going to collide. Yeah, Dare to Dream doing it quite mm -hmm. often, too. No. And Dare to Dream is choosing the right option here, having the percent lead. He has no reason to approach, um, so he can uh, take this lead um, for as long as he needs to. And just steal that fire for some health. Mm -hmm. Is that like 3% back to him or something? I don't know. It's, 5 to 2. It's not amazing, but it's, it's better than nothing. Yeah. And he just pops it out, and he's got a shine at the end. He tried to um, re-grab the sword in the air, but just barely missed. Oh, excellent forward smash. Definitely. Going to get some free oh. percent just from that uh, um, uppy. Nice damage. Another forward smash. Oh, he's going to taunt. <laughs> Very disrespectful. Oh, but, back air. but calling his shots just like that, taunt and then kill. Very disrespectful. Excellent kill from Dare to Dream. That was a beautiful back air. I don't really see that many Lucas plays. Uh, players around here, and uh, it's kind of cool to just see Lucas is just the backflip spike. Mm -hmm. Dare definitely has a pretty commanding lead right now, uh, and it looks like he just kind of wants to stick to that strategy, just throwing out whatever he really feels like from a distance. Just throw out a bunch of PK fires and kind of get Robin to come in. I mean, you got to stop. Lucas from saying PK fire. It mm -hmm. just gets it's it's too much after a while. Yeah. He definitely has to pressure out Lucas from being able to do um, a lot of his abilities, but getting so close to him can also be risky because yeah. of his hitboxes. They're so Robin's large. Robin's definitely not a up close and personal player. Mm -hmm. And being able to space out with Lucas means that Lucas doesn't have to be up close and personal, but he definitely c close range Lucas yeah. beats out Robin, I think. Well, because of um, Oh, Oh, right in the face, but Lucas is living. Mm -hmm. Definitely not going to kill at such a low percent, uh, not even having to recover with the upbeat, being able to uh, tether grab. But like I was saying before, if um, Robin has to use her spells, then Lucas can just suck them up and take back health and percent. So there's yeah. really no zoning that out. Is going to no, not it's kill? not actually. Excellent DI for coming from Dare to Dream. Yeah. Considering My 150% goodness. with a little bit of rage on Robin. An, an impressive lead still here by Lucas. Even though oh, oh up air will mm -hmm. definitely kill. Robin just wiping away the sweat of that first stock, just begging for nothing but a JV two oh. stock, which I'm very afraid of right now. Not going to happen though. An excellent six percent to stop that JV. He might just oh. gain it all back just from a uh, P uh, PK psychic. Could be. Is it still a JV if he heals back to zero? Is it? Somebody check the wiki. I'm gonna yeah. I'm gonna need some I'm gonna need some smash boards. I've always help wondered with this about one. that. That's interesting. Like if you heal your character back to back to zero, is it still a JV? Hmm. Things to ask the Smash gods. I'd assume no, but <laughs> what an excellent first stock that was um, by Dater Dream with Definitely. that uh, with that dare. Um, back here. Oh yeah, that was back here. It's very true. Everyone thinks it's uh, dare because it spikes it, but and, and yeah, when things spike downwards, you just I mean down Assume dare. Yeah. yeah. So um, they don't call them dare to dream for nothing. Yeah. See now in the opposite scenario where uh, Lucas does have ten percent, he does now have to approach. But returning that percent with uh, the forward smash and some PK fires, now he doesn't have to. Now I can just zone. Now I can just PK fire. Yeah. Which he seems pretty comfortable doing. Just keeping his space from Robin and mm -hmm. just staying out of her range. She has to find a way in, and he's just kind of stopping everything she throws at him. And mm -hmm. I think she just has to find a way in. But I don't think Robin's fast enough to get in on Lucas. I think this matchup is just terrible for Robin, actually. Yeah. The more I watch it, the more I think, you know, Lucas wins up close, but he can also keep Robin uh, out enough that um, she just can't approach. Because if Robin approaches and gets in your face... If you're faster, you're probably going to beat her out. Yeah. Um, but if you can also space her out like Lucas can, like he can just barely keep her outside of her optimal range. And I, I, don't, I don't know what XL is going to do if he can't get past all these PK fires. 
XL in the beginning, oh, and that oh, is going to kill. Board, yeah. bro. Uh, in the beginning, was able to uh, shield and roll past the PK fires and really get into Lucas's face and grab. And just like now, <laughs> um, being able to grab him in, in zone where he is is very important. And XL is showing that, that he can stack on damage. Oh, Very excellent edge guard. That's not going to kill. Lucas is definitely coming back from that. Oh. Um, so sad. Ooh, trying oh. to go for the spike on that, which would have been very impressive. Oh, we got a forward air. Still not enough. Lucas with those air stalls at the down B. Oh, mm. it's... Neutral bead, still not dead though. It's kind of you know, sad. It always would, looks like it hits so much harder. I well, don't you would know. think Lucas would be a little bit light, uh, light enough to at least die to that. And, and, and with Battlefield's uh, very low. No, it's got large hit. Is, is it large? Yeah, yeah it's, okay. It's got I've, large blast zones geez. compared to most of the others. I need to do some studying. In fact, it's got the largest blast zones of all the stages. In I the always get it mixed up with some other stage that has like a low. This is just bad. Allergy anyway. And. Excellent edge guard. Still trying to get him. Oh, poor throw. Pretty safe with that tether grab. Excel doesn't really know what to do when he tries to do that tether grab back. He just. Mm -hmm. Robin at high percent again. Jared Dream still has his first stock. His Lucas is looking pretty sharp right now. Yeah. Oh, oh wow. my. Now let's see if Robin's going to be able to come back from such an, a high percent, not lead. Uh, the up air. An excellent JV2 stock from Dare to Dream. Uh, grab combo. It's just going to do Down it. Down throw up air. Yeah. Next match. You got it. This patch is pretty dry, man. I mean, Marth, got, Marth and Lucina got some buffs, but I'm all, I'm, I'm all for switching the Bayo, dude. Okay. Yeah. That's dude, my kill actually did super good against Punk Panda. Oh really? So who is this guy? I've not heard of his tag. Uh, I don't know. He's 